guys, welcome back to my channel. Amanda here. Today, we're just doing a good old fashioned clothing haul. I have, oh my goodness, this is probably a month to a month and a half worth of online orders that I just haven't had the time to go through and open and see what's in them. So I need to go through things and look at them to see if I'm keeping them, see if I need to return them because we're getting close to that return date. So I figured we could just do a nice, fun, easy haul video of all the clothing items I've purchased in the last couple weeks. And don't mind this look. Today is the first day of summer and my kids have been fighting all day long and it's 10.08 and they've already been in timeout twice. It's gonna be a long summer, gonna be a long summer. So if you hear screaming in the background, that's because my children apparently can't get along anymore. So, I have a six and a four year old, so they like to butt heads a lot. So, if you would like to see what clothing items I've purchased for us for this summer, just keep on watching. So, I ordered a couple shirts for Ben and he already went through and opened them, but I picked up this one. It's I Love Ben in this teal color. And then there's little palm trees on it. I got this at Macy's for him and I just think it's so cute. Um, no, I'm sorry, I got this at Kohl's. Um, the other one that he's been wearing, it's like a light blue and then it has hot pink flamingos on it. And I love that and I'm so excited that he liked it too. And then I picked up just some shirts for William um, for the next school year. So at William's school, they have a dress code. They can only wear orange, gray, white, and tan. And at the beginning of the school year, it was so hard to find shirts because a lot of schools now do dress codes. And so online, anywhere, it was just, I ha it was very limited of what I could find. And he, so we never had that many short sleeve shirts. We were pretty good for winter because in, when I was shopping in the summer for summer clothes, summer clothes, like warmer clothes for William, that all the short sleeve stuff was sold out. But I could find a whole bunch of long sleeves so I bought all the long sleeves that I could get and the color schemes that he has to wear and we just made do with the short sleeves that he had. So I picked them up. Um, I got these from Kohl's and they had a crazy, crazy good deal going. It was like buy one, get two free sort of thing. They're all jumping beans. They're just little collared shirts um, cause they have to wear collared shirts, all solid colors, like I said, in their color scheme and their school colors. So I got him stocked up with all of those so we don't have to stress about it at the beginning of the school year. And I bought the next size up in case he has a little bit of a growth spur over the summer because he's growing out of everything right now. Luckily he's like growing up, like not out if that makes sense. So I didn't buy him any pants because whatever pants fit him now, they won't even fit him next month. So, but the shirts will be okay. So there's no rhyme or reason to this haul, like from the stores. If I remember where I got it from, I'll try to remind you, I have all my order slips right here so I can go through and see like, okay, what needs to be returned, what's being kept. But being a mom, I'm a huge online shopper because especially with having two little boys, they don't want to go sit in the dressing room and wait for me to try things on. So I order things, try it on at home. If it fits, I keep it. If not, I go return it. Um, and so it works that way. But I got some really cute pajamas. When I got these, um, I'm in the middle of planning a bachelorette party and we were thinking about making a weekend getaway and they were on crazy good deal. Like I've never owned a pajama set before, but it's just a short sleeve and shorts. And I bought them in a bigger size just so they could be nice and flowy. And they're a really soft material. I got these from Kohl's, but they have flamingos on them. And then I also picked up, I love pineapples, like love pineapples. And I picked it up in pineapple, so I'm so excited for these. Also, I picked up from Macy's. I We have a couple of weddings this summer and we're going to Florida for vacation. And so I just wanted to have some cute dress options. So I picked up this little, you can wear it over the shoulder or like across the shoulder, like this. But it's just this really cute mid-length, kind of like a high-low longer in the back and shorter in the front bright blue dress and I just thought this would be so cute for Florida if it fits I haven't tried anything on yet so we will see but I thought this was so cute and this was like on crazy good sale too so it was awesome I ordered tons of swimsuits so don't judge me I already went through and kept one for sure because I already wore it because a couple weekends ago we had like such beautiful weather and then, so we like were playing in the splash pad all weekend. It was Mother's Day weekend and it was just beautiful weather. And so we were in swimsuits the whole time playing outside. And then ever since then, it's been pouring down rain 
It's Memorial Day weekend. I'm in a long sleeve dress right now with leggings because it's chilly out. I mean, at least the sun's out today. But, and we're leaving for camping in a couple hours and it's supposed to rain the entire time. So I think I jinxed us by buying all these swimsuits. But like I said, don't judge me. I will probably only keep two or three swimsuits and then the rest I'll return. It's just the swimsuits I've had, I've had four years. Like one of them that I finally just got rid of was a maternity swimsuit that I had when I was pregnant with William. And William is, will be seven this summer, so it was time for new swimsuits. So this is just a little top. I, I obviously really liked it because I accidentally ordered it twice. It's just like a normal little top, so we'll see. I'm more so, I like two pieces, like ones that aren't showing my stomach. Um, but this summer I'm kind of more into one pieces and so I ordered up some one, so I ordered a couple one pieces to see how they fit and the one that I did end up keeping for sure already is a one piece and it's so cute I'll have to try and remember to show you. But this one's cute, it's got the ruffles, but honestly I kind of don't like the ruffles. It looks like it's a little too big like in the upper part and so this one most likely will go back even though it's really cute. A lot of these, these are the first time I'm looking at them so. Ooh, this one's really cute. But I don't know if you can see like this part, it's like sheer. It's kind of see-through and I mean nothing's really, really hanging out. The top part isn't, but I can kind of already tell I don't like how short it is. Um, Cause if I'm gonna wear something flowy, I want it to be covering. So this one, as cute as it is, I could probably tell you it's going back. Oh, here is a one piece. And all these swimsuits, because I can't, without looking at all the receipts, all of the swimsuits are from either Macy's or from Kohl's, if you like them. So this is a really cute one piece. I like the stripes. I like the different pattern on top. I kind of think it's gonna be a little too high-waisted for me, like come up a little too high. So this one, see this is why I order tons because out of all of them, I only keep one or two. And it doesn't bug me to return things. Returns are really easy. I always keep my re receipts with them. Um, I package the things in bags with the receipts. So when we go in, it's a super fast process. So it doesn't bug me at all to have to go return things. This from here up looks really cute, but I'm afraid it's gonna be a little too high-waisted. Um, and I don't want like that much side showing. Um, so this one we'll have to try on. This one, I just love, love the color scheme of this one. It's another little tankini. It's got a cute little keyhole in the back right here by the clasp. But I just love the colors of this. It's so cute. It might be a little short for what I'm looking for, but I like that it's straight and it doesn't have the ruffles, so it's not adding extra volume where I already have tons of volume so this one so far I think might be a keeper as long as it fits right this one is super cute oh so the one that I thought I bought two of this one I actually bought it's a one piece right yeah it's a one piece skirt it's got attached bottoms and it's so it's a little bit longer so this one out of the two I'll probably keep this one but again depends on how it looks like their ruffles are cute and all but I already have enough going on here that I don't need to add more like emphasis to the stomach. So we'll see how this one fits. Now this one I did try on already and I think this one is gonna go back because it is just too short for what I am looking for. I just really liked the concept of it. It almost just looks like you're wearing a sports bra with a tank top over it, which I just thought was super cute. And it felt really secure on the top. Like I liked how high up it went. I don't necessarily like the razor back because I just feel like, I don't know what's the difference. I don't mind striped tan lines here, but a big razor back in the back would probably drive me crazy. So this one is really cute and it fit really well up here. It's just, it was a little too short for what I was hoping for. And I also didn't like the big gap right here so you could see just that little chunk of roll right there. So this one's super cute. Oh, this one I got from Kohl's it says, um, but this one will be going back. As well, well this one, I tried this on that, like I said, Mother's Day weekend when I was trying to find a swimsuit to wear because these had all just come right around that time. This one's really cute and it again has, um, it almost looks like it's a two-piece in the sense that it looks like you have a swimsuit underneath and then a tank top over the top. 
really cute um fits really well up top it's actually a little bit too big that's one reason i'm giving it back it's too big around and then too short and so i just don't like where it kind of cuts me um at the bottom it's a little too high up so this one will be going back as well oh this one's cute i don't remember this one oh it's got little bow ties at the top this color is so cute especially when you got a nice tan we'll just have to see how the length works it might be a little short but this one's really cute and it's got some boning on the side to help give it structure so that this is the back of it that's just super cute i like kind of how high up it goes on the back and covering up the side so we'll see this one i think this one looks like it's from macy's but that is really cute this is just another swim dress it's got it's a one piece and then it kind of has like a dress dress shell over it just to give a little bit more coverage to classic black this is from Kohl's it is super cute it's a super 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 mom suit and sometimes I'm okay with that so I this summer I just really wanted to get out of like the swim dresses because that's usually what I wear and I just kind of wanted a different look but this one I thought was it was super cute it's good to have one on hand so we'll see how this one fits this one, I love the look of this one. I love the straps on it. It's so cute, it's a one piece. However, it is just way too big, so I'm super bummed about that. So it will be going back. It's just so cute. So it kind of has this, where it kind of does a crossover. It's a one piece, like I said, has a really pretty open back, but it covers you in all the right spots that you want to be covered in and hold you in. It's got a really cute straps on the back. I just love, love the print but it is just it's too big so i mean that's a good problem to have but it's too big sadly so this one will be going back and this one is from kohl's as well this one i'm super excited for i just love the top of it how it has the crisscross it's another one piece has the crisscross and then you can tighten it around so if it is a little bit big you can just tighten this and it'll um, form fit it a little bit more to your body it's got a cute little wrap to it and then the bottom of it is just black. This is from Apartment 9, which I believe is from Kohl's. Um, but it's just super cute. The back crosses, or you can change the straps around to make it into a halter. You can change the straps around to just make them regular straps. So we'll see what supports. This sister is the best, but this one I think is super cute. Can't wait to try that one on. Last but not least, I can almost tell you for sure that this one's going back because I don't like it. It's not cute. I don't know why I ordered it. So it's a two piece, which was cool though, because it came with the bottoms. Normally you have to buy um, them separately. And I just, I don't like the print. I just, it's a nice high waist bottoms, which is what I really like. Um, it's cute and the length is perfect. And I like how it comes up kind of high. So if I'm not wanting to try and fall out everywhere like if we were going to a swim park or something i just don't really like the print very much i just it's not really my style so i mean i'll give it a go and try it on but i'm pretty sure this one's going back hopefully at the end i remember to show you guys the other swimsuit that i'm keeping because it is so cute if not i will add a picture in here all right next up this is kind of like a really random a little bit of clothes but I got a couple collared shirts for myself I got a white one I got a pink one and then I got a cute coral one because um, Ben and I or Ben's trying to get me into go golfing with him a lot more and when we went golfing last I actually had a really hard time going through my closet trying to find stuff that was like golf appropriate and so I picked up some cute hot pink kind of almost on camera they pull a little bit more purple but I thought this would be really cute to wear with the coral or with the white shirt just kind of classic golf pants and then I picked up just a pair of black ones which for all intents and purposes they're leggings but they have the nice streamline to them so it looks like I'm wearing golf pants and the golf material but they just slide up and down so it's nice and comfortable so I just had to get some golfing clothes so I don't get kicked out of the golf course all right and last but not least this last order is is from chic soul they're an online clothing boutique who i'm obsessed with i believe if you go to shop chic soul shop seek why is it so hard to say shop chic soul um on instagram you can pull up their site and it is just 
that's where this is from and I have this in like four different colors I have like a majority of the clothes I get now are from chic soul um, and before that they would be from Target sometimes Target's kind of hit and miss for me now I don't really like a lot of their new brands um, but Macy's and Kohl's mainly Macy's so if I could only choose two places to buy clothes from now I would choose chic soul and Macy's that's where I find my best finds especially online um, and especially for plus sizes like yes there's stores that have plus size in store but for the most part they keep a majority of their plus size stuff online so if you are plus size and you're trying to find more options just go to all the stores you shop at and go look at online because they have way more of a selection there all right and like I said we have a whole bunch of summer vacations coming up a couple different weddings and so, and graduation parties and bridal parties and so I wanted to have a couple of really pretty dresses and this one I am so excited about I love the print on this I love the top of it it's nice and conservative I don't have to worry about wearing a tank top underneath because I don't want to spill out I'm not I don't know like modest but I guess I kind of am like I'm not prude I guess is what I'm trying to say but I don't want I mean I'm forever running around chasing after kids or bending over picking up toys or something that's fallen down I don't want to worry about falling out and so I like to be covered I mean I don't need to be in a turtleneck but I just like to be covered it's it's just my personality so this one I love the print on this so I can't wait to try that on oh this is cute I haven't I don't remember like I said I ordered all these things a while ago and I'm just not getting to it so it's almost like it's Christmas morning that I don't remember what I ordered so this one is another full-length dress that has again the really nice coverage it has it's a little bit lower neck but it has a really cute twist um, element right here to just to give it a little bit of structure and a little bit more Wow but this print is super cute and obviously I thought it was super cute because when I was opening this order I ordered a tank top a nice cute flowy shirt in the same exact print by accident so luckily I think it's really cute but that's just a nice flowy shirt sleeveless um, it's got a really I have a couple of these just in different colors already and the ruching just goes all the way around so you feel like you're just wearing like jeans and a t-shirt but it's just a little bit the flowiness to it gives it a little bit of a nicer aspect this one I think is so cute and if I had to choose Oh, I thought it was a shirt or a dress, but it's a shirt. This one I think is my favorite item that I purchased. It's a nice short sleeve, and again, it has the ruching that goes all the way around. So it just gives you structure up here and then flows away from the body, which being a little bit larger, I don't like clingy things, and so that's perfect. I like it when it flares away just a little bit, so there's nothing clinging. But it's got a really cute navy stripe and daisies on it, which I just think is adorable. This one is super cute. I think this one's probably my favorite purchase. Now for Chic Soul, you can do returns. It's a little bit more difficult because they don't have a store. Um, and I've been shopping with them for probably about a year now. And everything has always been amazing quality. This, by the way, isn't sponsored. Uh, and I mean, Chic Soul, if you want to sponsor me, I would totally go for it because I love your stuff. But I just really enjoy the products. Their materials are great. I used to be really into Kiki LaRue, um, which they still have really cute stuff as well. They don't carry as much plus size as they used to carry. And the materials were kind of hit or miss. And so this stuff, nine times out of 10, it fits me perfect. It fits true to size. And some things, um, I'm on a weight loss journey right now. And so some things are a little small, um, but my next goal weight um, that I'm aiming for, they would all fit me perfectly. So I've honestly never had to return anything, so I don't know how well their customer service is with that, but I imagine that it's pretty good. They come with return um, addresses, return slips to make it nice and easy for you. So this again is just a cute little basic tee, but it just has the embellishment on the sleeves to make it just a little bit dressed up. Like I think with a long necklace, this would just be really cute. I really love wearing coral. Um, especially in the summertime when I have a tan it just pops that much more and especially with my dark hair I've always just enjoyed wearing this color I'm a big dress person if you can't tell I like wearing dresses especially with leggings just because one you look super put together and then the leggings aspect the whole chasing around kids all day long I can bend over nothing's falling out so I bought this really cute sleeveless dress which this one I think is adorable too 
Um, it's got the cute pattern to it. And it's about mid, I'd say it probably, it, they hit me about knee length to this one might be a little bit longer. So this one might hit me mid shin, which again, I'm super into. So this one I probably wouldn't even need to wear leggings with. It's a really nice soft material that looks like it's gonna breathe really well. So this one would be really good for the midsummer when it's really hot out. All right, and this one is just another cute, basic little shirt. But again, it just has a couple of more elements to it just to make it a little fancier. Um, I like the different blockings of it all and just super cute. We have a whole bunch of camp trips planned, so I still wanna look cute while camping and I can't wear majority of my closet camping, so I needed to add some more t-shirts to the mix. Oh, good old 4th of July shirt. This one, I'm a little sad because it looks a little small, which who knows, maybe if I stay on path, maybe it'll fit me by 4th of July. But right now I can tell you, I know it's not. It's just the clingy material, so it's not as loose as I was hoping, but it's a cute little lips um, with the American flag, which this one does. I won't return it because it was fairly cheap and it'll fit me if not this year or next year. But was kind of super excited. I don't know if I've ever been able to wear, since being a child, like a 4th of July shirt, and I always get them for the boys, and my husband always wears one, and so I just kind of wanted to join the gang, but I don't think that it's gonna happen this year because I'm not gonna lose that much weight in the next month. Ooh, another really cute shirt and a really cute color, and with sleeves that are folded, just to add it, give another added element. This one looks like it'll be nice and flowy. I sized up a little bit on it just to make it nice and flowy. Um, but again, super, super soft material, which in my opinion keeps me a lot cooler when it's hot out. This one, I don't really remember ordering because it's not really my cup of tea. It's a little bright. It's a little bright. Like this is like neon, neon. So this one might just be like a swimsuit cover up. Maybe that's what I was thinking when I ordered it. Cause I just don't know. I like bright colors, but I'm not gonna like wear, go out and wear bright colors kind of thing, but it is really cute. It's a really cute dress. Um, it'd be a cute swimsuit cover up. So we shall see. And last but not least, I think this, is, uh, as I just said, I don't like wearing bright colors and then I bought this and I'm super excited for it. So maybe it's just how the bright colors are portrayed, which where is the top? This is so cute. I love the design to it. I like the little, double layer sleeves just gives it an added element I love the colors in this I would wear it with some leggings or some I have some really skinny um, white like jeggings which this would be really cute with that like tight and a knot to make it a little bit shorter but this I think is super super cute super excited all right guys that is it again don't judge me this was like a month two months of online shopping um, I feel like I have to clarify. I only shop when there's a good deal. I got really good deals on all of this. Um, everywhere I had a coupon or especially Kohl's, I got tons of Kohl's cash. And so then I would just make another order with that Kohl's cash. And so after making my first purchase, I really didn't have to pay again for the other stuff because I bought new bedding. So I got a solid chunk of Kohl's cash and then I bought some stuff and they were still doing Kohl's cash. And so I used my Kohl's cash to buy stuff and then I got more Kohl's cash and since I had more Kohl's cash I bought some more and then I bought some more so just look for the deals and like I said make sure you do your returns there's nothing worse than buying something and then missing your return date because then you're just out money on something you don't want to wear and something you're not going to get your money back on so I'm going to go through all this get the receipts all together try everything on and start making my returns next week. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. Like I said, it's Memorial Day weekend. So this weekend we are going camping. This will probably be up um, on Memorial Day itself. So I hope you guys are having a great weekend slash had a great weekend and having a good Memorial Day. And I will talk to you later. Bye.